Hello everybody and welcome to Uprising 144K. I'm Hydrogen Man. Guys, I got awesome footage from Japan showing how to measure hydrogen gas properly for inhalation so that way you know exactly how much you're getting. There are different methods guys such as chromatography, mass flow controller methods, gas sampling methods and it all depends and you can see right here they're showing the 2019 premium edition of the Hydrofix. There's different methods depending on what type of hydrogen generator you're going to be testing. In this particular case because they're going to be actually using the cannula that comes with the device they're going to use the gas sampling method. It's the most appropriate and adequate way of doing it. You don't want to add any more length to your cannula or anything in between the device and the tip of the cannula because that would just make the test invalid. So what they're actually going to do is do a vacuum. And in this vacuum, this is all Japanese equipment and that little glass vial they're using, they're going to pull and actually take 100 milliliters of air and then they're going to release only within one second. And you can see right there it was just shy of one second, but that was close enough. And then what they're going to do, based on the color, it lets you know in 100 milliliters the percentage of hydrogen gas that was within that test. It has at least 2 milliliters, or 2%. So, in 100 milliliters, and you're looking at 2 milliliters in that one second, what you're looking at is at least 120 milliliters per minute or greater, which is right there around therapeutic grade. And the important part is that you're getting really clean hydrogen. You know it's safe. You know the levels are correct. And that's how you do a proper test, guys. If you guys want to test or more information, really, a longer video, on all the details about how to properly do the hydrogen testing for the gas inhalation, and all the different devices and what they're used for. Just something way more detailed and involved and explaining percentages and just all that kind of stuff. Let me know and I can go out of my way to try to do a video like that and get you guys some more interesting footage. But I at least wanted to release this short footage to show you guys how it's done properly and so you can actually see the numbers from the Hydrofix because a lot of people have had questions about that and some people on the internet have actually been measuring it incorrectly and so a lot of people have been getting confused guys. There's a lot of misinformation out there so I'm going to do my best to bring you guys accurate information so that way you can get the information that you're looking for. So guys that's it. Please support the channel by giving a thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe. Don't forget to hit that notification bell so that way you'll get the notifications when I release new videos and that's it guys. Thanks for watching. I'll see you next time on the next one.